Hi everybody, Kathleen Pence from Pence Law Firm here. Now, if you've watched some of these videos before, you know that we've talked about how important it is to have your estate planning documents in place, like your power of attorney. But what happens when you have a family member who needs, needs help and doesn't have the power of attorney in place? What do you do? So today we're gonna to talk about adult guardianships. An adult guardianship is a way to help your family member when they need it most. Now, when we think of adult guardianships, we usually think of having an adult guardianship over an elderly family member, but it can really be used for any family member who has an issue that prevents them from being able to take care of their medical, financial, or daily living needs. This can be anything from dementia and mental illness to cancer. One thing to think about too is if you're a parent of a special needs child, when they turn 18, they're now an adult and you don't have the right or the ability to help them make the decisions that they need. This includes financial needs, this includes medical care and talking to doctors about what they need. So if your child is approaching the age of 18 and they have some special needs that they need help with, it's really, really important that you go to the court and get adult guardianship over them. Now there are two types of guardianships, one over the person and one over the property. And you don't necessarily need two different people. Now the guardian over the person helps this person take care of their medical needs and any other of their daily needs that they need, may need help with. The guardian over the finances helps this person take care of their finances, which includes things like paying bills and even investing. Now, in order to get adult guardianship, you are going to have to go to court. And the person that you want to get guardianship over has the right to come to court and say whether or not they want you to be their guardian. But ultimately, it's up to the court to decide who is the appropriate person to serve as guardian. Now, if you have an adult family member who needs help and does not have a power of attorney in place, and you think an adult guardianship would be the right thing for them, give us a call. We have helped many families navigate this process and help their family member keep their dignity throughout. So please give us a call. We would love to work with you and your family.